All right, a good evening, everybody. We are back here at Lecom Park in Bradenton, home of the Bradenton Marauders, for game number two between the Clearwater Thrashers and the Bradenton Marauders. I was here last night, opening night. It was fantastic. They had a lot of giveaways, promotions, a lot of new merchandise in the store. We're still going to check out some of that uh, merchandise tonight as well. Not going to show a whole lot of the game because I already uploaded a video from last night and it's a lot of the same stuff. So tonight is going to be focused more of myself. I'm just going to enjoy the game, have fun. Uh, there is a fireworks show tonight brought to you by the uh, Bradenton Marauders baseball club and it is going to be a fantastic night fireworks show at the end of the game tonight so i'm going to stick around and film that record that for you guys so without any other interruptions let's head on into the ballpark and check out some more promotional opportunities as opening weekend continues here in Bradenton. of course now that we finally made it into the ballpark we got marty Marty out meeting and greeting everybody. I'll show you guys. There we go. Looks like we got a, a pull-up bar. And of course the face painting from last night. We got all kinds. Of, it's going to be a little bit more crowded because it is Saturday night. So there's going to be a lot more families out here at the ballpark from than last night. But we got ourselves a uh, pull-up bar. Part, part of the Marines. Part of the Marines. Four. All right. Let's see how he does. Wow. More merch. This is the new merch from uh, for this year. They got the team store on Canon stuff. I like the polo. I like the gray polo. The Marauder on the, on the uh, but, but they do have the green team right here, which I like. Yeah, and these are but, uh, I really wish they had um, black one. That's going to be too hot for the summer months. They had the um, shirt. Maybe they'll have another shirt giveaway tonight. Hopefully they do. Hopefully they have another shirt giveaway tonight. Hopefully they grab one right quick. And that will be my shirt. Free shirt. I'll take it. And of course for those that are traveling in groups, you also get group tickets and you can pick up your free pack and drink. Right here. That's what this long line is for. A lot of, a lot of families, a lot of people out of town, out of state, come to minor league baseball parks because honestly I like them way better than major league baseball games. Just because of the atmosphere, it's smaller, it's more family oriented and overall just a lot of fun. Alright, so I got sports clips cards for uh, coupons for sports clips. So if I'm ever down here and I'm doing something and I just need a haircut, I'll come here. So I'll come down to one of these locations to earn my free coupons for a uh, free haircut. Of course, if you always come early enough to the ballpark, you can always get the opportunity to get some autographs and pictures with some of your favorite Marauders players. Well, see the Bradenton Marauders warming up. And now, the starting lineup for our 2024 Bradenton Marauders. Our Marauders are managed by the skipper, number 16, Jim Horner.
finally done a strike. Hooray. Ah, uh, stolen base. He picked him off. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I can't That's a plan. I don't know. No, it's not. Two and oh, two and one. Oh, yeah, that's way out of play. Oh, I don't know about that. I thought that was a strike. <laughs> Two outs. That's a good pitch. That was strike three. He's out. Three outs. Going to the bottom of the first inning. No score. Uh, oh, no. Look at him go. Look at that speed. Oh, man, it's Sonic. All right. Oh, two and oh. That works. Why would you swing at that? Drop, 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 drop. Oh. And the dugout. Oh, that was a three up, three down inning for the Marauders. 0-0, zero, zero, going to the top of the second. Got him again. Not a boy. Yeah. Not a boy, Mike. Not a way. Got another steal. Stolen it. <laughs> We're three for three on pickoffs. All right. So, I'm going for a snack. A quick snack here. Because I'm hungry. I did eat at home, I had some dinner, but I'm for a snack, can you give me a pretzel and a uh, and a um, pretzel with some cheese. I'm going to see if there's my food Gatorade that I already have back in my seat. So, let's get to it and gonna enjoy my snack for the evening. Okay, so I was just announced on TV or on the video board without warning. <laughs> I thought they would record it. Oh well. But YouTuber, spend pictures. Yes. Also, check this out. I got myself a free hat. I was walking up by the scoreboard up here on the mezzanine in the outfield, and there was just a hat laying on the ground by the table. I was looking around to see if anybody had dropped it. I was going to give it back to him, but no one has claimed it. So, we're going to hopefully, uh, no one claims it. I got myself a free hat. Yay!
wait for that traffic to <laughs> All right, so thank you all for joining me here in Bradenton, home of the Marauders baseball team. Uh, it was not a good night for Bradenton. They got blown out badly. Uh, 13 to 2 was the final. But uh, good news is, I was actually recognized on the Jumbotron. Uh, I, uh, for my YouTube channel, and, uh, it was like a shout out to who, uh, special guests that were at the ballpark, and I, I, I found this hat on, uh, the, in the outfield, uh, bleachers, and I was looking for somebody that might claim it. But no one had claimed it. Everyone else had a hat on. And it was mostly these hats. So I got myself a free hat. And then... Uh... Just now... Uh... As I was getting into my car... Uh... A baseball... Literally... Fell... Or came behind... Flew behind my car... And hit the gravel road... And... Here we go. I got a baseball. So, um, and then it, and then it rolled into the road. But, so I got a baseball, finally. And another one I could add to my collection. So, um, other than that, uh, other than the disappointing loss, it was a great night tonight. It got a little bit cool, cool uh, cool out. Um, it's only 67 degrees. Um, I did wear long sleeves because I knew it would be cold, cooler, but I did not think of to wear pants. Uh, I will next time. Uh, hopefully the weather holds up. I'll be able to wear, I'll wear some, uh, I'll wear more, well, long sleeves and, of course, whatever. Uh, and pants, not shorts. My legs got really cold. But, thank you all for watching this spin venture here at, back at Lecom Park for game number two of the opening opening weekend for baseball. Um, we will be back here in a couple weeks, uh, April 20th, when uh, the Marauders will take on the... Uh, I don't even know who they play. But, we will be back here at Lecom Park uh, to cheer on the Marauders and have a great time at the ballpark on a Saturday night. But tomorrow we will be heading on another spin venture. It is April, the first weekend of April, so it's time to go get the cookie of the month at Gideon's Bakehouse right after church tomorrow afternoon. And we will be getting that cookie of the month. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to Spin Ventures, leave comments down below, and ring the bell for notifications. And so, we will see you all tomorrow at Disney Springs. Good night from Lecom Park in Bradenton, Florida, home of the Bradenton Marauders.